Okay, so I'm Anders Olsson from Toby Technology. What I have here is a laptop with an eye tracker built in. Uh, what an eye tracker can do is measure with about a quarter inch level of precision where the eyes are looking at a screen. What you're going to see here is how we combine this uh, with the touchpad to make it possible to do everything you would otherwise do on a tablet, but now instead you can do it uh, on a laptop. And a lot of things become very easy to use. So to start off, if I want to launch an application in Windows 8, all I need to do is hold down the Windows button, and then uh, whatever I look at will automatically light up. So I'm looking at the Explorer now, but you can ignore that because I'm going to open up Word. So now I go down to Open Word, and then as I uh, release, uh, Word opens up for me. Now here in Word, I've got two Word documents open. And if I want to scroll through them, just like I would on a tablet where I would do this type of thing. Uh, here, instead I just look at whatever I want to scroll through and then quickly swipe, swipe up on the touchpad and it'll start uh, scrolling for me. Now I want to go to this one and then I swipe up the same way. Back at the left one, swipe back down and the, the document comes back for me. So going back now into this dark menu, I can do a lot of other things as well. For example, I can get a very high level of precision that I could never get on a, a touch device. So if I go into Excel, for example, I can uh, really hit each and every individual uh, cell here with ease. Uh, on a touch device, I would uh, touch down, and then if I try to hit that cell, G3, it might mess up and then hit G2 instead. Same thing can, of course, happen with gaze. But here I have the advantage that my finger's not in here. So if I want to touch the cell I6 here now, I just hold down my finger and then, if necessary, I find you and I can always get right to where I want to be. If I want to make the text bold, I just look up there, hit the bold button, etc, etc. And this, through this way of interacting, I can do all kinds of things that would otherwise be kind of boring and tiresome to do on the laptop, the way I've traditionally always had to do it with the keyboard and mouse.